Hello, this is Mr. Kent of MrKent.com. And recently I have been concerned about uh, having difficulty connecting uh, the, the Bebop 2 with the Sky Controller and the app on the phone or the tablet. And uh, one of the things that I have experienced recently and uh, have been uh, trying to share the good news is that if you will reboot your tablet or phone before you begin um, trying to connect, you'll have success. If you do everything, all the other steps properly, you'll have success every time. So um, I'm going to go through the process here and show you uh, how it goes. But on my uh, tablet, I have three different apps. And I don't want two apps competing for the same spot in memory. So I'm going to show you in this video how to make sure that you only have one app in memory when you go to fly your, your drone. Now, I've already started the drone, uh, the Bebop 2 drone, and it's sitting over here running. I'm going to now connect my USB cable to the, to the tablet. If I can do it without fumbling. Okay, so that should be connected up. <clears throat> okay, so I've got my Sky Controller and my tablet hooked up with the USB cable. Now the, the uh, Bebop is already turned on. So uh, normally I would, <clears throat> I would, about this time I'd be turning it on and then wait about 20 seconds for it to get fired up. Now I'm ready to turn on the Sky Controller. So I'll turn it on and I want to run the AR Pro 3, but probably Sky Controller is going to try to bring up Free Flight Pro. We'll see what happens here. Okay, I don't want to use Free Flight Pro. So I'm going to cancel, and I'm going to do the, uh, on my tablet, I'm going to make sure there's nothing, uh, there's no other apps being used. Now I'm going to go in and start the uh, AR Pro 3. And yes, I want to use that. So we'll put that one into memory. And I should be able to tap this guy up here. And, uh, yep, I know all that stuff. Okay. Thank you. Appreciate your help. So there we have it. Now then, if I want, I can get out of this app and clear memory and go into AR Pro or the, uh, the uh, Preflight Pro. But I'm going to stop everything and uh, reboot my tablet, and then I'm going to go into Preflight Pro. Because if I don't do that, I'll have troubles while I'm flying. So I'm going to, first of all, turn off Sky Controller. Then turn off the uh, Bebop 2. Then I'll turn off this app. Okay. So that's the end of this segment. Now I have to reboot my tablet. And we'll start up with Free Flight Pro. Okay, I have rebooted my tablet. Now I'm going to go ahead and turn on the um, Bebop 2. You can hear me probably doing the switch. And then you have to wait about 20 seconds or so for that to get uh, ready to go. And um, then I'm also, uh, I probably should have plugged in all the uh, USB cables. So I just did that. And... Uh, I got all the USB cables connected up. I've got my uh, my uh, Bebop 2 running. I have already rebooted my phone. Now I'm going to do something here, and we're going to see how well it works. I think it'll work just fine. But uh, I'm going to turn on Sky Controller. Sometimes Sky Controller, um, when it comes on, it demands to get the the Free Flight Pro rather than uh, letting you choose uh, AR Pro or the thing. So we're going to go ahead and, uh, okay, well, that's kind of crazy. We're going to go ahead and let, let uh, Preflight Pro come up, get up and running. But we don't want it. We want to go back and we're going to get something else. So now that we're in there and we did that by mistake, we're going to do whatever your tablet does to uh, be able to, uh, kill the app. So in this place, in this way, I just hit close all. 
Okay, now I'm, we'll go with Ariga Bebop. And now it asks me, when I closed all the programs, that wiped all the, the other program out of memory. And uh, so now we're ready to go with uh, uh, Sky Controller 2. Okay. And now we've got our connection that we need. So, <clears throat> uh, and if we, ca if we can minimize it, we can go in and minimize this and see that it's the only program that we've got running uh, on this tablet. So we would be safe to go fly uh, after turning one off, clearing it out of memory, and starting another one, um, another app. So that way also works. Uh, I wouldn't recommend it because, you know, all we can see is that, yeah, we, we stopped the program, it's no longer running, but who knows what's left in memory that it was using. So I wouldn't recommend that, but it is possible. And if I wanted to go fly, uh, now I would probably have no problems at all. So he's looking for a GPS. We're in the house. It's never going to find it. <laughs> so anyway, we'll wind this up. But I want to thank you for watching and God bless.